Hello friends! Welcome to another exciting episode of Learn with Morale. Today we're embarking on a thrilling journey to understand diverse habitats, those special places where animals and plants call home, brimming with both living and non-living elements. So, are you ready to explore some fascinating habitats with me? First, we have three main types of habitats to explore. Let's start with the forest, a bustling city of nature, brimming with towering trees and a myriad of creatures, from the smallest insects to the largest mammals. Forests are like nature's playground, filled with an abundance of life. Next, we dive into the aquatic habitat. Imagine a world beneath the waves, an underwater realm teeming with a colorful array of fish and plant life. From the shallowest tide pools to the deepest ocean trenches, aquatic habitats are full of fascinating creatures and plants. Finally, we step into the desert, a stark contrast to the lush forest and vibrant aquatic habitats. Deserts may seem barren at first glance, but they are home to resilient life forms that have cleverly adapted to survive the harsh conditions. From cacti that store water in their thick stems to animals that stay cool by staying underground during the day, deserts are a testament to the tenacity of life. Now you may wonder what's the difference between a forest and woods. Well, let's find out. Forests and woods both are teeming with life, but they are not the same. The forest, my friends, is like a bustling city with layers upon layers of life. These layers or floors start from the ground and reach up to the sky. The first floor is home to mosses and roots. The second floor is a garden of herbs, flowers, and ferns. The third floor is a bustling neighborhood of shrubs, and the fourth floor is a towering canopy of trees. On the other hand, the woods are like a cozy town, less dense and with fewer layers. It's more open, allowing more sunlight to reach the ground. The woods may not have as many floors as a forest, but it's still a vibrant place with a variety of plants and animals. So remember, while both forests and woods are vital habitats, they are different in their structure and density. Now let's take a deep dive into the desert habitat. Deserts, they are more than just sand and heat. Imagine vast landscapes, some hot, some cold, some sandy, others rocky. In these seemingly inhospitable habitats, life thrives against all odds. Plants have evolved to hoard water, while animals have adapted to survive with little to none. Imagine a desert oasis, a jewel in the arid expanse, teeming with unique plant life. So you see, there's a lot more to deserts than meets the eye. From the dry deserts, let's now plunge into the depth of oceans. The ocean, a vast, mysterious world beneath the surface. It's a watery wonderland teeming with life at every depth. From the sunlit shallows home to darting fish and bright corals, down to the dark abyss where strange creatures roam, the mid-levels are a highway for migratory species, while the seafloor is a bustling city of critters. Plants too, like seaweed and kelp, thrive in this aquatic habitat. Such diversity all in one place. Aren't these habitats amazing with their unique features and inhabitants? And that's a quick tour through some of the world's diverse habitats. From the lush forests and vast oceans to the intriguing deserts, each has unique features and inhabitants. Thank you for joining me on this adventure. Don't forget to subscribe to Learn With Morale for more exciting learning experiences. Share this video with your friends and let them in on the fun too. Until next time, keep exploring.